All right, today we're talking about circumference. Maybe you've read the books about circumference and the Knights of the Round Table. Hey, check it out. It's a pretty good book. So our first question to ask ourselves is what is pi? Now you've probably heard that pi is 3.14. You might even know that it's an irrational number, but do you really know what it means? Pi is actually the ratio of the circumference to the diameter. In other words, take the circumference and divide it by the diameter. That ratio is what pi is. So if you forget what circumference is, circumference is the distance around a circle, kind of like a perimeter. Diameter is the distance across a circle. Now this formula is really easy to use, but I'm going to show you how to express your answers in a couple of ways. Circumference equals pi times diameter. So if our diameter is 10, all we would have to do is say, hey, circumference equals 10 pi. 10 pi? Is that an answer? Yes, 10 pi is an answer. You'll see that sometimes on quizzes and tests. 10 pi or 10 times pi. But a lot of times we multiply that out and we go 10 times 3.14, that's 31.4 meters around in this case. So it's 31.4 meters around the circle. Now, in this case, sometimes they only give you what's called the radius. The radius is not the diameter. It's only half of it. So if we have a radius, we need to multiply it by 2. That's why you sometimes see the formula circumference equals 2 pi r, or 2 radiuses. 2 radii? 2 radiuses. I don't know. But either way, you have to have two of them in order to get all the way across the circle. So in this case, our answer could be 20 pi, because it would be 20 times pi, or, if you want the real answer, the answer I like, it's going to be 6.28 meters. And in this case, remember, it's approximate because pi is really not 3.14. Matter of fact, there's contests. You can say 3.14157, blah, 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 and that's what pi is. So it's always an estimate. It's never exact, but it's close enough. So, circumference equals pi times diameter. That's all you got to know.